Well, good day, lads here. Yeah, BBPN coming to you one more time here. It looks like we're now well into truly week three. So we're going to go take a look at what's going on in the divisions here. Let's start things off with the Sunish division. After that, we can maybe even take a peek at the exchange later today. It all depends how many of you all show up and say, give me me fix. All right. Let's get it started here. Slanish division. Cue the music. Okay, here we are. Yes, it is the nice division. It is the fun of week three, and you see what you do you see here, it's the niche. It's actually, as you've been heard told, there's a dwarf team of all things here. So we're starting this one off with a bang. It is gonna be for week three to start it off. Chaos versus dwarves. Now let's take a look here at the teams. As you can see here, skill ups have already started happening in the first games. Block here. Mighty Blow here, and of course Claw. It's an elf division, but you can tell why he's taking Claw to piss off the other teams. It's not like he's actually wanting to score touchdowns, apparently, because otherwise, obvious skill he should have taken is, of course, you know, extra arms. Oh well, not like he wants to win games anyway. And of course, here you see your hero, yes, the finest dwarf team you will ever see, coming on the field there, and they've already gotten some crazy skills there. Mighty Blow on the first Trail Slayer. A movement increase of all things on one of the runners and dodge on the other one. That is some crazy skill rolls. Three re-rolls here and apothecary. Three re-rolls and apothecary. But all the fame's cheering for chaos because, well, they're chaos. What else would you cheer for? Oh, well. And there we go. It's a riot already. That's going to make life absolutely fun and delightful. Okay, so let's see what gets going on here. Chaos consume you! Well, he's going to try, all right. He's definitely going to try. All right, dwarves are on the move as we speak here, and they're going to get stuck in right off the bat and see if they can do some real damage here. There we go. Solid blow. Two dice. Down goes the Chaos Warrior. Let's get to fighting. Well, they've got the fighting already. There's a stun right off the bat. And meanwhile, the rest of the lads moving on in. Can they do more? Yeah, it looks like they're just like they're gonna do a little bit more. Gets the Dauntless, in he goes. I can't shoot straight unless I've had a paint. Well, someone's having a point, all right. Down he goes there. And now they're charging in. That's two. And now he's just on three. And that's how baby dwarfs are made. Ah. It's kind of terrifying. Three for three. Who says chaos is thick armor? Three hits, three breaks, fortunately for him, only three stunts. But yes, I agree, that's kind of crazy. He's got the hands, well done. And he even gets away with a pass, doesn't he? I'm TNT. I'm Dino Mate! Oh well, Chaos wants to get a little bit even here. This honor will be ours! Only gets a push with a cheeky bastard and then goes and runs and hides like the coward he is. Meanwhile, the rest of Chaos here, well, they're going to have to wait for some of the team to start recovering. Bit of a shame, that one. I guess he got lucky. Uh, Chaos getting into the screening position here. They're thinking of maybe going after the ball, but that is that. All right, Dwarves on the move. Which is saying something, considering the stuck little legs. He's getting a few things marked up in here. Ah, uh, yeah, he's decided it's time for more beatings because beatings is the way he should be treated. Oh, there's me drink. Get in my belly! Ah, uh, and there's a celebration. He's gotten a victory right off the bat there. Quite the player, this little sunshine here. And there's the first injury. You got lucky the first turn. And the dwarves are definitely on the move. You're starting to see the advantage of a movement seven runner. This is a dwarf team that actually knows what speed is. And the rest of them get moving. 
Ah, it looks like he's definitely just like he's going to try and turn the flank here. Got more balls moving up. Even makes a GFI. That looks like everything is hunky dory with him. All right, back to chaos. Well, now the front line finally recovers on turn two, turn three, and stand up to figure out what just hit him. Now yep, Chaos is getting in position here, trying to turn the flank back the other way. And they are hopeful to actually get some kind of result here. Quick push, mate, push you on the dwarf. That is pretty impressive, considering how those buggers hardly move. Ah, there he goes, cheeky bastard as he is. Ah, well. The path to ruin! Gets the knockdown, fails to penetrate. That's what his wife said last night. And here we go, Chaos continuing on. Another cheap knockdown here. Can you make it three? Of course you can. And there we go. I've done punching dwarves. Everyone's favourite sport in the sleep. Alright, turn four. What can, what can the dwarves do this time? Well, good idea. Stop beatings. Lots and lots of beatings. And you can see they're getting tagged up here. Because they do want to take advantage of the fact here. The Chaos team only has the three skills, and only one of them is actually block. So he's going to try and make sure one in nine is not his friend. And speaking of not his friend, guess who's come showing up again to have a life good laugh. And here he goes. Locked and loaded! And he's got another one. Ah, there's much disaster there from the Chaos Coach. It's only a KO though, not what the bastard deserves. And a bit of cheekiness here from the dwarves here, taking a bit of a chance. And then he fails this one here. Red dice up, Bill, and he blows that one. Take this, you bastard! Yeah, it didn't work well. Well, that's happens when the dwarf gets a bit of a swag here. And now he's actually giving himself a bit of a problem. Well, Chaos decides he better re-roll this one here, because he's probably going to come in the backside. That's how he likes it, and that's how he's going to do it. Moving on in. Chaos coming around to try and contain this dwarven incursion deep in the end. And yes, he does even get a cheeky blow in. You will be killed by traitor's hands! Not today, Sunshine. Yeah, well, he's stunned for a while. And the pummelings continue. Bit of a push along there. He has made the pathway he needs. And now here come the rest of the cowardly vermin running back. Here it comes over the top. Makes all the rolls, of course, and even gets the pow. There you go. Attack! Attack! A bit eager today, aren't they? Oh well, he's not the dwarf, and there he goes. He's down. The battle is lost! And rightfully, he stuns himself. All right, back to the excitement now. Dwarves get back in action here. All right, what's he got in his, you know, container this time? Now well, he hopes he's got something. Well, there we go. Solid hit. Knocks the bastard away. And the rest of the dwarves, you can see, they've actually decided to scrum over here. Gets a good solid hit. And now the sprightly young lad here, he's only 128, he goes running across the field. Bit of a gamble here. One dice does get the push he wants. And now, does he decide to get the ball? No, not just yet. He's thinking about it. He's going to do a blitz away first. Bit of alright. Gets the solid punch, knocks him out. And he's wonderfully stunned. Uh, here comes this lad again. And he's got a couple of angry issues, doesn't he? As you can see. Alright, now he's going to try and get this ball. There we go. Gotta go. Me too. And he's in. Well, a bit of extra celebration there from the sister, and everything is off and running. Unfortunately, Chaos looks out and gets his KO back. Oh well, let's see what the scum there does. Let's turn this around here. Chaos actually, believe it or not, did come in with one reserve. <laughs> Past tense, one reserve. 
Yes, at this point here in the season, this Chaos team has gotten remarkably lucky and has actually managed to acquire reserves. They haven't suffered from untimely deaths like other Chaos coaches have in this league. As for the Dwarves, well, they've got the full roster and they're still ready to get going here. All right, let's see what we get on the kickoff this time. Once, you know, Chaos actually figures out what the hell he's doing. Come on. Damnation! Where is our support? I don't care. It's probably in the bleachers still trying to figure out where their seats are. You know how those lots are? You give them an assignment. And of course, because they're Chaos fans, well, they can't actually go where they've been assigned the seats. And they're probably still standing around arguing with each other. Which is great fun for the Dwarf supporters, isn't it? Alright, let's get this started here. There's the wide kick. Oh dear, there we go. It's a bribe for everybody. Money, 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 everybody. This is going to make life absolutely interesting, isn't it? Oh well, let's carry it on, shall we? Thank you. Uh, it's a lucky catch already right off the bat there for Chaos. He's got the ball in hand. And now he's off and running. Now, fun fact here, Chaos Warriors here. A little bit better here than your standard... You know, Nurgle Warriors here, because the Nurgles do trade off. Uh oh, here we go. A Chaos Foe is near! What are you talking about? Well, the Skong's actually gotten a cheesy KO, unfortunately. And now he's going to continue a relentless assault on the poor, brave, strapping lads on the front line. There you go, what you deserve, double score, but he rolls it back from a double one to a double six. And he gets to advance forward. Comes the rest of Chaos charging in. Yeah, you can see, yeah, he's trying to actually show his my Kismo by actually marking things up. And there we go, cheeky little attack there. Oh, the poor innocent dwarf. And knocks him flying on his little stunty ass. Alright, Chaos on the move here. Guess it, it looks like they're going to go right. They haven't decided any other direction. Oh, look here. Bravely, they decided to cage up, even though he's a strength for Chaos Warrior. Nice to see your courage is lacking today. All right, Dwarves. Let's see what he can do this time, Sunshines. Charging on in here. Yeah, it looks like they've got a plan, and their plan is kill something. Some would say to the Dwarves, this is always the plan, and it's a pretty good one. All right, here we go. Solid it. You've got a chip on your shoulder. Mm, yes, and a bit of fish, too. All right, what's he doing over there? Hey, look, one dice. See, that's how a real man does it. And now here we go. He's going to go and take care of this one. <laughs> Burning, looting, bombing, shooting. Well, unfortunately there, he was pulling his punches there. It's only a stun. However, Dwarf takes on the Chaos Warrior, pushes him back. And yes, you just saw a miracle there. Dwarf actually figured out how to dodge. Gotta go. Me too. This is going to be one of those crazy games again, isn't it? All right, Chaos. Starting to peel around the sign here. Bit of a risky move. He's going to have to screen things up a bit. As everyone says, this is a, this is your old commissioner's favorite move, the side cage. Absolutely a favorite move. Chaos getting the act back together here. Trying to figure out how do they screen this one up. <laughs> No, so much for defense. That looks cheap two dice. Gets a solid punch in. And down goes the young lad. And meanwhile, that does break a Chaos Warrior into the background here. And here we go. Another cheesy attack as usual. Oh, look, it failed. One and nine. Oh, well, he gets another solid hit. Fortunately, doesn't do anything there. Annihilate them! Not today. And there he goes and picks on the other one. Because that's about all he knows how to do. Alright, Dwarves, what you got back? You're going to stand taking that? How about a double skull? Shows the dice aren't going all one way. This is my boomstick! Uh, there's a good solid KO. Get rid of the filth from the field there. They're soiling the good sacred field of Nuffle here. Alright, Dwarves get back on the move. Are they actually going to let this one in? They're not sure yet. In fact, right now, all they see is what they call targets. Lots and lots of targets. Take this, you bastard! Now they're working on it. Me want another one die there. Push me, push you. Now what? He's actually going to chase them. Uh-oh, there we go. We got you to sight and screw this. It's time for the boot. 
I shot the sheriff and the deputy and your wee doggy too. Yeah, well, he doesn't care. As long as he does a bit of pain. There we go, one dice, solid punch. Does he get the lad? Oh, uh oh. What do you need? Yeah, he got that one too. And he's actually making a complete mockery of this chaos armor. Who needs mighty blow to overwrite it anyway? Push me, push you. Dwarves might be letting this in, but then making sure the chaos knows what they actually think of them. And the answer is absolutely nothing. All right, scrums in out. There we go. Finally, the one in nine comes up as the way it should be. <laughs> yeah, pretty much that was stifled quick. Here we go. Turn seven. Turn eight, actually. Does he get the score? Some of the dwarves are looking at this going, could they actually get this one? They're thinking about it. They're actually thinking about this one. But step one, a couple of beatings because that's what dwarves do best. And he knocks that little lad down. Well, here comes one running. That's about as far as he goes. And now you're about to see Bill Bexley speed and dwarf dodging at its finest. And yep, he actually made it. Nimble little bastard, isn't he? Here comes the last one. And he fails! Locked and loaded! He's gonna try that one more time. Time to go! And he fails that one. I've got the beast in my sights! Well, he had something in his sights there. Ah! Our old foe! Well, he tries this one here. It does get the push away. And uh, yeah, there we go. He's gonna run in. And he's gonna score that one. Yeah, yeah, we've heard enough of that one there. The insults are flying. Welcome to halftime. Boy, this is becoming an intense battle between these two. This halftime is brought to you by Mighty Blow. It's a true American hero. Mighty Blow. All right, so far, Chaos is getting off lightly there. And fortunately, one of the little young lads is coming back in. Yes, celebrating his 152nd birthday. He's having a great old time in this game. All right, dwarfs on the defense there. They like what they see. And now let's see if the scum sucking chaos can do something. Hey, he's down more players, and rightly so. All right, let's get this story there. Hey, look, an undeserved reroll. Absolutely fantastic. Engaging the enemy! Well, it's not like chaos needs rerolls anyway. He's only got four of them. And of course, now the great thing is, because he wasted his time buying a claw, he may actually have to take care of the ball first. All right, here we go. Back to the old punching on the front line. And the dwarves are going down like dominoes. Well, they're going down worse than my sister did last time the team visited the hometown. Three hits, three knockdowns, and then here comes crazy as crazy is. He charges in. Exit quickly! To glory! And he's actually pulled himself a KO out of nowhere. Unfortunately for him, he's not taking this and the dwarves are pissed off. <laughs> yep, you saw that right. He actually pulled the key, the KO to keep the player on the field. Now, well, here comes Cheap Shot. We must slaughter the monster! Well, I don't know if I call Dolph Lugnut a monster, alright, but I've heard what he does with his bowel movements and they're pretty disgusting. Maybe they've got a point. Alright, dwarves. If you want a grudge, this is it. It's time to give them payback. And it looks like the dwarves are moving in position to do exactly that. You foul his players, he's gonna foul your players. And guess what? He outnumbers you, sunshine. This might not have been your smartest move. And here come the dwarves moving on in. Come on, shorty. On our way! Yeah, and now they're going to go and get some work done here. And yes, before you say it, it indeed is short work. It's them! Bust them! Yeah, there we go. Some sort of poundings. What's he got? Yes, he's got him. Well deserved indeed. And yes, there's much anger there. Now that's what you get when you piss the dwarves off. And yes, he's apothecated that one.
And guess who's starting to recover? Yes, he looks a little extra drunk from Saturday night. And now the Cowardly Chaos. Reroll that one. Greed, and it doesn't work. FRESH VICTIMS! Oh well, that's what you say. The dwarves, you're just opportunity targets. Here comes Chaos rolling down the field. They are planning on trying to get this touchdown quick because, let's face it, looking over here, they need their players back. They're now down three. And here they come, charging forward. Meanwhile, the scrum continues there. Oh, there's a good solid hit, and unfortunately, he's got that one. Kill! Kill! Yeah, it's killed, all right, and that might have been fully the thing that's pissed the dwarfs off more than anything else this game. Well, it's not a Blood Bowl game unless it's a confirmed kill. For once, it's not the dwarves. Some would say maybe that didn't look like a good idea. Well, let's find out. Was that being too aggressive? Ah, uh, maybe, maybe not. REVENGE! Yeah, as apparently I've gone and taken a dive. Why would I play for this scum-sucking team? Alright, dwarves. Time to plow the road. And the road has a ball at the end of it. Yes, I know they're, they're unsprightly and ungainly and they're all shriveled, but we want his balls. And guess who's back in the mass again, yep. Yeah. Fresh from his KO, back on. We did, you roughing bastards. We've been watching you all along. Yeah, well, he's come back with a fire in his eye and a spring in his loins. And suddenly, a penis on the forehead of a Chaos Warrior is truly KO'd. Well, never mess with dwarf penis. Those things are called Warhammers, after all. And speaking of Warhammers, someone else is unzipping as we speak. And there we go. Aye. Does he get any more results? No, he doesn't. Lucky bastard. And meanwhile, <laughs> springing away, they're going to beat up a few more of them. Why? Because that's what they do best. Hey, look. Lads down, he actually survives. And now the dwarves are about to get a little crazy. They're actually coming around the side. For those of you counting at home, the Chaos Warriors, congratulations, they're starting to run out. There's only seven left on the field. Well, that's what happens when they pick a fight with a dwarf team. And here he comes, heroically charging over, double skulls as he rightly deserves, and has to re-roll that into just a bloody push. Once again, this is why you buy extra arms first, not claw. Point given. They are too strong! Yeah, well, you're about to find out the hard way there, Sunshine. Alright, brave lads, time to plow the road. Preferably with, you know, nice chaos corpses. And here they come, one more time. I think they've done playing with their food over here, and now they're going to come over here and go, Hey, look, there's a football. Let's actually go get this thing. Yes, the dwarves are remembering there's actually a football involved. And here we go, one more time. For Iron Forge! And he's gone and taken out yet another one. And there's much rejoicing and much angst from the Chaos Coach. Quite the lad, this one. That's his second confirmed kill, pretty much. Well, maybe he can go for the trifecta. Or is that the dissection? I can't tell some days. Speaking of, here goes the other young lad here. He aspires to be like his partner. Yeah, well, at least he gives him a good fisting, and down he goes. Tally ho. Do you risk picking up the ball? No, he's actually going to mark up very aggressively. And now he comes running in with the other guy. Rolling along, isn't he? Yes, it's amazing when you see speed on dwarves. Push me, push you. And yes, for those counting it down, the chaos count is now down to six. I always love that game. Alright, let's see what the Chaos has left in store. Push me, push you. He does have a crazy plan, gets away with the cheap dodge. And he does actually hit the poor boy again. Oh well, down he goes. You are marked for death! Now well, he's marked for something alright. Preferably a good shagging. Alright. Does mark the ball, gets the ultra receiver in here. Chaos, one die. Crazy is on as crazy is. Gets the block. Has to go with the push instead. And now here comes the cheekiness, and once again, shows you why he's bought the wrong scores again. The power of chaos gives us strength! 
Maybe. <coughs> yeah, but it's not giving you the fucking ball, is it? And now here come the dwarves here. Yes, and they have a grudge. And you standing around the ball is probably not the healthiest thing for your team right now. In fact, let's let's practice this theory, shall we? Here comes the young lad one more time. And yeah, lucky you, it's only a push. End of the ball, ball is free. And look, it's only a push, the poor bugger must be tired. Get some dark ale into that dwarf stat. Dwarves moving around here, now they're actually going to try and pick up the ball. Uh-oh. Hey, you! Catch! Well, he caught something all right, and I suspect it's VD. Well, that's giving him slippery fingers, hasn't it? All right, here we go. Chaos, the surviving Chaos players. There are still six of them. Now they're going to have a bit of fun getting the ball. And you can see right off the bat, there we go. Skull changes it into a push. Smart move will be going around this way. Clearly, of course, not the smart move. Here we go, and he's fucked that one up again. Oh, well, there we go. Damnation! Where is our support? The battle is lost! Not yet. There's still some counting to do. And he's got rid of another one. Eat mortar! Eat lead! Yeah, there's a KO, and now it's five. Don't worry, they're not done with him yet. The day he's still young. Oh, no, wait, turn 13. Well, young from a dwarf's perspective. And are they done punching? Well, step one, actually go and get this football thing. Yes, he's got it this time. What's that? Get your finger out of that bunghole. And now the dwarves. Well, I like to say, they think they got this one. Shoot the cow! And have they got rid of this one? Yes, indeed, and it's another well-deserved injury. Yes, absolutely. Well, like I said, this is what you do when you piss the dwarves off. You get what you deserve. And now that leaves how many of these young lads? Yeah, you can count it with me. There's only four of them left. Yeah, which according to the dwarves is still four too many. Ah, fails that one. He actually decides to use a precious reroll. First reroll he's used to laugh. This is how pissed off he is. Now you can see here, yeah, Chaos is making a brave attempt to actually try and chase this down. This might be the only brave player on the entire team. The team of a bunch of cowards. Alright, he's swaggering his own way down to a touchdown here. As the dwarves, you know, they like to go and take care of this thing. They're dead! Well, you can only hope. Ah, well, you know, Chaos will actually survive. Not because he's a brave one, but don't worry. Well, I'm pretty sure Chaos can take care of this problem. He's an extra player down just to make sure. And here come the rest of the young lads here to, you know, show a wee bit of fisting. He decides to give this one an excuse to actually stand up. Does he want to stand up? He's not too sure. How about you, Sunshine? You have a target? I'll take care of it. Ah, he will, all right. What's he get? Nothing. Yeah, well, the doors must be tight. You can see there it is. Chaos is surrendered. And they're rolling over at this point here. Yeah, they just give this one up. And it's time for the dwarves to celebrate a well-earned win. Born underground, thrown inside the rocky room. The earth is a cradle, the mountain shall become our tomb. Face us on the battlefield, you will meet your doom. We do not fear what lies beneath, we can never do. And the dwarves do celebrate. It might have cost them one, but that became a critical apothecary there. 2 1 is the victory. Chaos has to go back and rethink their life decisions, and the dwarves will march on in this strangely elven division. Well, that was a fun day, wasn't it? All right, we'll take a look around the rest of the league. Thank you all for viewing, and Nuffle, bless your dice.